Hey guys, welcome back to Kara's Cake. If you haven't already guessed, I've been awake since 5.30 a.m. It is now 5 to 11. And this is what hair looks like after it has been in a bun in a hairnet for over six hours. Cute. Today, I just wanna show you a quick video on how I freeze and store my cakes. Um, it is very late at night. I just finished baking up some cakes. It is Tuesday evening and I made my friend Jenna's wedding cake. Um, the wedding is obviously not until Saturday, so I am making the cake ahead of time just because we're gonna be so busy. I'm gonna wrap it and freeze it, take it out at the end of the week to decorate it so I can show you how I wrap and store my cakes in the freezer. So here are the cakes, they are completely cool and I wrap them just like this. Um, they are cooling for about an hour and I'm going to use saran wrap and tin foil. So I'll show you how I do that. So here I'm getting the tin foil ready for wrapping the cakes. I rip off three bigger pieces and three smaller pieces for the layers. Uh, here I'm taking two pieces of saran wrap and laying them one on top of the other wrapping the 8 inch cake and then wrapping another piece around it to make sure it's all the way sealed. Then I take the piece of tin foil and wrap that up tight. And next I'm taking a sharpie and writing what it is, so vanilla 8 inch and it's December 17th. Just so if I was to leave this in the freezer for longer I would know exactly when it was put in. I think this is just habit from when I was in culinary school. We would write everything down in the date just so we would know. And here I'm just continuing doing that until all six layers are wrapped. Alright, so as you can see, my 3 8 inch and my 3 6 inch are all wrapped up and ready to go in the freezer. I just like to add that when I take my frozen cakes out of the freezer before I decorate, I like to take them out the night before or at least 10 hours before because I don't like to decorate frozen cakes and I thaw them completely in the tin foil and everything before unwrapping them. Alright, so I also freeze my buttercream ahead of time if I have to. Um, I made three triple batches of buttercream for the cakes that I have to do this week. Um, I popped those in the freezer downstairs and I put those in Ziploc bags and I can insert the clip here showing um, how I do that. This is a big Ziploc bag and a triple batch of my vanilla buttercream. I always mark on it the date and what it is, what flavor and I pop those in the freezer. I try to make them as flat as I can so I can stack them up and the same as the cakes, I take those out the night before, at least 10 hours before using them. And I usually only leave them in the freezer for a week or maybe two weeks at the most. If you have any more questions about freezing and storing cake, you can comment down below. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. And if you haven't already subscribed, please cl click that red subscribe button. And I will see you next time.